Welcome back to another episode of Super Goober Sunday! Woo! Party, 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 no swimming. Party, 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 oh my gosh. We are in for a great day. It's very exciting and uh, we are going to be cooking up a really, really cool treat for these guys. So, we made an episode back in the day talking about when we used to custom make Coda's food before we figured out a good food brand for him because he has severe allergies. And you guys really, really enjoyed that episode. So today we wanted to try something a little bit different and we are actually going to be cooking these guys a puppy pizza. That's right, a pizza that's safe and actually pretty healthy for your dog. So this is going to be a lot of fun. We're looking forward to it. It's going to be our first time trying. I haven't done this before. Have you? Nope. She has not done it before. What, is this, fly. you made it up or is this Pinterest? No, I be honest. This is in Pinterest? All right. I, I took the pumpkin cookie recipe and then I eliminated pumpkin and I added chicken and we're gonna hope that works. Okay, hopefully it does work. I see one little guy who's very excited over there. Coda always loves to eat, you guys know that. Let's get it cracking. Okay, I'm not quite sure what's going on here. But believe it or not, Coda actually has a tennis ball in his mouth. He's never played with a tennis ball before. This has never happened. He wants somebody to come get it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, girl, what are we starting with here? Flour. Flour, we're, we're making the dough. We're gonna start with dry ingredients, yes. All right. So we need to do one cup of flour. Okay. I'm not letting you touch this because you'll make a mess. <laughs> I would. You can zoom that you're not touching flour. Go ahead and hop up here if you want to help cook. Oh. He's, he's going to make oh. sure you're... Oh. He's, he, licked, <laughs> he licked flour. I also shut the lights off on accident. He just licked pure flour. That can't taste good. He just sneezed it all over me. That can't taste good. Ducky. Ah. Alright. So we got the flour in there. Then we need to do a teaspoon of oregano and basil. Okay. And that's gonna give it that pizza. Ooh, that does smell pretty good. Yeah. That's all the dry ingredients. The flour, oregano, and basil, and then we're just gonna mix it up. Next, we have one cup of water. And then we're gonna what use- What is that? It's chicken bouillon. Oh, it looks like mustard and baby food. Taste what? it. It's good. <laughs> Yeah. What in the world? I've never seen that ever in my life. We're just gonna take a little bit of this in our one cup of water and then mix it up so they get a little chicken flavor in there. Oh, we're gonna like that. Coda's already thinking he might like it right now. <laughs> Next, you need to scramble this egg. Some scrambled egg, no problem. And all this is going into the flour mix? Yes. Does that smell good, Coop? Okay. Is this exciting? It's gonna taste way better when it's actually been cooked, I promise. Okay, so we've got this all whisked up. I almost just dumped that entire thing on the table, and we are gonna put it in there. And I'm just gonna, I'm gonna you can call me T. Fieri. Is that his name? The guy Ferrari? Ferrari, no, it's not Ferrari, it's Fieri. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it's Guy Ferrari. I don't know about that one. Call me Rada T. Martin. <laughs> <My God. laughs> ah, I'm the dough monster. You tore it apart. It's okay. We can put it back together. You get it on the flour, and then you want to fold the flour in into it. Into it. Okay. I see you. So eventually it should get to the point where it's not sticking to Well, I have a lot of this stuff. Well. Take, take some wine. Yeah, put, put it in there. It's you want to flower my pen, girl? It's so gross. Look at this perfect circle we have forming right here. This is beautiful, ladies and gentlemen. How thin are we going here? Or what's the plan? It's probably good. Now it goes in the pan, right, Coop? And then it goes in the oven? And then it goes in your belly. This is where we have to use teamwork. Okay. I'm gonna lift it up and you kind of like slide, slide the pan it. in there. Yeah. Just like I slid in them DMs, right? Okay, here we go. Oh, Lordy. Put it down, put it down. 
Transfer's complete. We did it. All right, so the hard part is over with. The dough is made. You guys can see it's sitting here pretty in the pan. These boys are fans of what they're smelling. It's got that oregano and that basil and stuff in there. It actually smells pretty good. Like, we could eat that, right? It's crust you for pizza. It's got pumpkin in it, though, right? No, it's chicken. Oh, the chicken. The you chicken bouillon, yeah. Chicken, but if I took that out... Still looks pretty good. Uh, now let's talk about the fun part, the toppings. What are we going to give these guys? Well, you guys know probably their favorite thing in the world are eggs. <laughs> you like eggs? You want an egg smashed on your head? Bam. Nope. Just kidding. Uh, we're going to scramble up some eggs and we're going to throw that as a topping on there. So that's going to be pretty good. We also have some ground turkey here because it got to be lean and healthy. We're not going to do too much mozzarella cheese, but we are going to have some low moisture part skim mozzarella cheese. Is this a sweet potato or a normal potato? That's a sweet potato. Sweet potato and broccoli so they get their greens. And all this stuff is 100% dog healthy. We already know they love all this stuff. So this is going to be pretty cool. Let's get these toppings on here. So we've switched it up on the fly a little bit here. Dogs can't have tomato sauce or anything of the like, so it wasn't going to have a sauce. Instead, we're going to do a pumpkin as the sauce. You guys know this is actually really good for the dogs and they really, really like it. And so I think somebody's a fan. Do you like pumpkin, bud? Do you like pumpkin? Does that smell good? Does that smell good? Huh? Would you guys like that as a sauce on your pizza? All right. Case closed. We're doing it. First step. Brown the turkey, scramble the eggs. You guys know the deal. I'm sure most of you guys know this. Let's cut forward. I think it's the color. Now, the most crucial part of this recipe is to make sure you have plenty of help in the kitchen. Otherwise, there's no way you could ever actually get this done. So, if you guys can see, our boys are just so thoughtful and selfless. They're both here helping out with the food. They're not in the way, especially if she had to like, I don't know, go over to this drawer. She wouldn't have any issue. Or if, if she had to go to the fridge over there, she wouldn't have any issue. They're just so helpful with the cooking. Final piece of prep is to cut up the sweet potato as well as the broccoli for our toppings. You guys can see over here, Koda was just checking them out. The ground beef and scrambled eggs are done. So we are almost ready to put everything on the pizza and get it cooking. Watch how dainty he is, ready? Koda, be nice. <laughs> I don't know if he's getting a treat or making love with the spatula. I don't know. watch this one. Okay. Ready, Koopy? Be nice. <laughs> Just ravages. All right, all the toppings are prepared. The oven is preheated. We're all good to go. So we're going to start with the sauce. Okay, so that's our sauce. Then I'd probably say the, the meat next. Should we the meat next? No, you always do cheese. Sauce, cheese, toppings, cheese. Okay. So that's our first layer of cheese. Okay. Right? Yes. Okay, now we can do the meat. Is this too hot? <laughs> She's gonna do the eggs. eggs. We've got some slices of sweet potato. I thought that kind of looked like pepperoni. That's pretty good. I already had a sweet potato and broccoli pizza. That sounds pretty good, to be honest. Honestly, before we added the pumpkin, I didn't think it sounded that bad. Right. Kind of sounded like a breakfast pizza. I dare you to try a slice. No, thank you. Or just a bite, not a slice, a bite. You what try a bite with it? What do I get if I try a bite? Uh, ultimate Super Cooper Sunday Street Cred. That's just not gonna do it for me. Come on! Drop a thumbs up on the video if you think Chelsea should try a bite. Well, let's get a little close-up shot of this bad boy. Because honestly, it's looking pretty good. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Of the dog meals we've made, this probably looks the most appetizing. Well, I guess that's it. We're gonna clean up here. We're gonna let this thing bake. You know about how long it's gonna take? 30 minutes. That's our guess. All right, we're gonna see how close we are. We're gonna come back. 
Once this thing is done, we're gonna check it out. These boys are gonna try it, and I think we are too. I'm actually kind of excited. It's like four o'clock. I haven't eaten yet today, so I'm pretty hungry. You do not think that's appetizing. I might like this. I might be fighting for the boys with this pizza because it looks pretty good. If it had tomato sauce on it, I would kill that thing. There's no doubt, but yeah, uh, we'll it's see what pumpkin happens. That's throwing me off. A little weird. All right, we'll see you guys in 30 minutes. Okay, so we've moved the pizza down into the bottom oven where these guys can see it. <laughs> and they've both have been just sitting here eagerly awaiting their chance to eat it. Honestly, I've been watching it too. That thing looks pretty good. I don't know, Coop, what do you think? There's about five minutes left and we're gonna be good to go. Are you ready for the big reveal, Cooper, Coda? Are you guys ready? So, I think it looked I don't know. It doesn't look bad. I think it might have looked a little bit better before it went in the oven. That's my opinion. We'll see what you guys think. I mean, I still think it looks it looks decent. I don't think I don't it know. smells good. I like eggs on pizza. Like, I really like Sweet. breakfast pizzas when you've got the eggs and the bacon and the gravy and all that stuff. So, like, it, it makes me think that that turkey is sausage and then you got the eggs. So, I keep thinking this is going to be a breakfast pizza. But it's not. See, I don't think it smells good, but I don't like broccoli. I don't like eggs. Oh, that does it not does smell not very good. Smell We're good. trying to bite, though. You down? I am not. You down? I am not. Come on. Come on. Come on. We're doing a bite. A little, little, little bite? No. No. Well, I'll try it then. So All right. I will videotape you. Cut me, a, cut me up a little piece. Cut okay. me out a little piece. All right, Let's do it. It's gonna be good. Also, I was messing around with Coda while we were waiting for the pizza to heat. Look at this. Look what you did to me. He went up for a hug and I grabbed his paw and he like, I don't know, he missed and kind of withdrew a little bit. And I don't know how his claw got me that good. Cause his claws aren't that bad. I don't know, that's crazy. <laughs> he thinks it's funny though. Okay, so just a fair warning. I don't think I'm gonna get through this whole slice. But, girl, do you want to take the camera? Okay. Should you do this like by the sink or the that might be toilet or something? Get some water. Maybe just have a margarita to just like really wash it. Oh, that's gonna be so bad. No, you have to. You have to know what it tastes like. First bite, you have to taste it without ranch. Okay. He really wants it. Okay. Like a veggie egg. Uh. <laughs> oh, the pumpkin. <laughs> the first thing I tasted was the ground turkey, and that was actually good. Second thing I tasted was the egg that was good, and then I got some sweet potato that was good. As soon as that pumpkin, that was, oh, oh, it just. <laughs> Honestly, it tastes a little bit like vomit. Like with it all mixed together, it honestly does taste like vomit and that's what made me want to vomit. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, that's not for me boys. You guys are disgusting, but I'm sure you're gonna love this. So, let's see what they think. Okay, so we're gonna give this one to Koo. Interesting way to eat your pizza, Coop. He just went for the straight side grab and swallowed it in almost one bite. He's got a little piece of crust left. That was actually really, really impressive. Okay, now it's the big boy's turn. So let's see what you've got, Coda. Of course, toppings first, just like with everything. <laughs> oh, oh, there you go. Good boy. He loves it. Look at those floppy ears. <laughs> he could crunchy. He could land a jumbo jet with those things. So how does a dog that's twice the size of the other dog take four times as long to eat it? <laughs> Goodness gracious, girl. you are such a baby. All right, well, there you guys have it. That was a lot of fun. We had a great time. I would have liked to do the jet skis today, and I know every episode I'm like, I want to do the jet skis. What's going on is we're actually going to be coming back, or about to come back, as of when you guys are watching this video. We're going up to Michigan 
for the weekend and it's gonna be a good time we are not bringing these boys no. so we kind of we had to have like something to do before we left and we just didn't have enough time today to like get Cooper out in the jet skis and stuff like that so we're probably gonna try that next week it's been really really warm it's been super nice so look forward to that in future episodes but hope you guys enjoyed we're gonna give you guys the updated recipe down in the description and if you guys want to try this out yourselves, feel free to share, you know, pictures and stuff on Twitter and Instagram and everything else. We each have Twitter and Instagram. Cooper has one as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. We're going to catch you guys later. See you next week. Peace out. I was told to bring the camera back quietly. They're just sitting here staring at the pizza on the table. <laughs> You're not kidding anymore. Was it good? I'd say by those two smiles, it was pretty darn good. We did a great job, girl.